Hi friends, it's Suzanne here from sunstampin.com, a Canadian Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Today's card features the Smitten Mitten stamp set, the Many Mittens Thinlet Dies, and the Winter Wonder Texture Impression Folder. So what I'm doing here, I have my piercing mat, I have inked up my little mitten with Bermuda Bay, and with a dauber, I am daubing on some tranquil tie just on the finger part of the mittens. I'm going for that look that when you go out in the snow and your mittens get a little wet and they get dark. So that was the look I'm going for. So now I'm using the thinlet dies and some washi tape. I'm going to run that through my big shot and I like to tape it down with washi tape so that they don't scoot around on me when I use my magnetic plate. Even though it helps a little bit, the magnets are funky. You probably noticed that in your crafting. All right, here we go. This is Pool Party ink, and I am just smearing it on the deboss side. So the side that has like a divot in it. Um, I don't know how else to explain it. <laughs> Um, I'm just smearing that ink on and now I have put the paper on the opposite side and I'm pressing down. Now when I peeped at this, I noticed I wasn't getting much of a, um, the ink transfer. So I opened it up and very carefully rubbed my fingertips along the paper and this helped to get the transfer that I was looking for. And here's the reveal. All right, so uh, Bermuda Bay card base here, using my bone folder to reinforce that score line. Fast fuse on the back of my background piece, adhering that into place. And now I will work on the mittens. I have some Whisper White Baker's twine here and I have a couple of dimensionals on each of the mittens and I'm just adhering the mittens in whichever way I would like to. I'm also going to uh, tie a little bow for the top and that was just to hide the glue dot that um, I wanted the mitten string to attach to. So, uh, you know, it's one of those things, you got a glue dot, you don't want the card to stick to the envelope, but I got to, you know, work with the design here a little bit. So I found that by putting that little bow right on top, it sort of uh, covered the glue dot and it looked like it was purposely supposed to be there. All right, trim the edges. And now um, I'm stamping the sentiment, may you have many merry moments surrounded by those you love. With Memento ink, I've cut it out with uh, the stitched shapes circle with a little bit of fat fast fuse, I have added that. And then I have some Wink of Stella here that I'm going around all the little snowflakes. And actually you can't see it on camera, but it looks fantastic. Thanks so much for joining me and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Hey, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. On screen are two more videos for inspiration. Click on the maple leaf to visit my website or click on me to subscribe to my channel. Thanks again for watching.